Kelly. I've been on YouTube almost as long as you have. Um, I started in October, I think it was, of 2006. But I started uploading videos at the time of uh, Halloween night. And uh, I like to mark that as the beginning for me. Well, you've got a few questions here. Might as well answer them. In fact, I think I should. How long have I been on YouTube? Well, I just said that. What motivated me to start actually making videos was seeing all these just regular, ordinary, everyday people making videos. Uh, there were three or four that really inspired me. Uh, namely, uh, Zipster 08, Geriatric 1927, of course, uh, Phaedrus, and Toshiba War. And I'm still subscribed to all of them, one way or another. Uh, let's see, next question here. Oh, I don't have any pets. No, I'm allergic to most pets, and I'm really irresponsible, so I can't handle pets. Uh, if you won the lottery, what's the first thing you'd do or buy? The first thing I would do if I won the lottery is that I would pay as much of my debts off as I could. Because I'm in, uh, all this traveling, you know, costs a lot, so I'm in debt up to there. Uh, if you could travel to the moon, would you? Hmm. Good question. I think it would be an interesting experience. Don't know what I'd do, uh, except maybe bounce around and drive one of those golf carts, you know, like for on the moon. Look around, just experience, see it. Yeah, I would go. Ah, let's see. Uh, when you were a child, what did you want to be when you grew up? I wanted to be a lot of things. I wanted to be a, a race car driver, an astronaut, a uh, fireman, you know, like every other kid wants to be. I don't think I ever wanted to be a policeman, though. Mm -mm. Did I want to be a taxi driver? Never. <laughs> Which would you rather do? Go to an amusement park or a museum? Well, amusement park would probably give me a heart attack, so I'd like a museum. You know, one, one with lots of dinosaur bones and mummies and stuff like that? I'd find that really cool. Okay. Which would you rather do? Oh, I did I did that one already. Okay. What's your idea of a dream vacation? Have you taken it yet? Well, I have a few dream vacations. I would like to go to Antarctica and and check that out. I would like to Yeah. Do Antarctica. Just you know, Antarctica cruise. But I think it cost about fifteen or twenty thousand dollars to do an Antarctica cruise and well as you know I haven't won that lottery yet so it's not going to happen anytime soon uh, so that's why not because I don't have the money uh, are you an introvert or extrovert? Eh, I'm a little bit of both for some situations I'm an introvert like now on my days off I'm an introvert I'm at home, I'm staying at home. Uh, when I'm at work, I'm more of an extrovert. I'm, I'm more entertaining and more outgoing. And I guess I'm more like that when I'm on vacation, too. More of an extrovert, but I'm the introvert right now. I've been watching YouTube uh, for the last, oh, almost 12 hours nonstop. Well, a couple of stops here and there, but I've been catching up. Uh... Next question. What would you rather do on a Saturday night? Go out dancing or curl up with a good book or movie? Well, I work Saturday nights. But if I had the Saturday night off, I'd probably be curled up with a good good book. I don't read enough. I don't read nearly enough anymore. Uh, you're stranded on a desert island with your iPod and lots of batteries. Which performer could I not do without? Well, you know, I tend to go through phases where I listen to 
one performer for a while and I'm really into it and then I'm not into that performer at all and then I'd look at something else and no matter how good something is or no matter how good a performer is there comes a time where you get tired of that particular performer but I would probably not do without Sparks just because they have uh, a lot of variety in their music and uh, they're kind of offbeat and uh... oh yeah stick your tongue out at me why don't you <laughs> Sparks sucks <laughs> anyway Sparks has a lot of variety and uh, they're they're just quirky and, and weird enough to keep me entertained so I'd have to say that but I'm sure that after a while I'd get tired of that too and oh look at this I come to the end already well there you have it I hope this video answers the questions you were asking and um, gets you a little more clued in on what it is to be a quig if you wanted to know that is Fat quick. 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 Fat qu